Hi, welcome to our video. Today we're going to demonstrate this Blanchard Model 11-20 rotary surface grinder, um, serial number 14375. Um, this machine is currently wired for 460 volts. It's just been serviced, painted, we cleaned out all the gearboxes, re-greased it, put fresh oil in it, um, done a few repairs on it. Um, this machine is equipped with the Trabon Central Lubrication System. One pull of the handle greases all of the critical points. Um, you get your table ways, the column ways, the spindle bearings, um, the up-down motor, all, all your, all your cr critical points, so you don't have to lube it manually all the time. Um, the table in and out is, of course, manual like it is on all these machines, and it feels really good. We just put it back together. It's all nice and clean. This machine does have it, have it a full half inch of chuck life left, which is really good for a machine of this age. 11 inch cylindrical wheel mounted on the machine with its own dresser. Some of these smaller machines with the cylindrical wheel don't have a dresser anymore. This one does with some fresh dressers in it. It's ready to go. Um, let me put the guards back on before we start the spindle. <coughs> that and like that run the table in start the chuck it's all the way up on its fastest speed right now let's go ahead and demonstrate those speeds that's 64 the fastest speed 41 rpm Kind of a semi-fast grinding speed for carbon steel and maybe harder materials, alloys. And this is 15, your slowest speed. Um, table drive sounds good. Uh, go ahead and start the wheel up, the grinding wheel. That's the spindle. Set the automatic feed down. Pull the lever down. And it begins feeding. Um, you can set your incremental feed down and arrange your anywhere from zero to 70 uh, thousandths per minute. Right now it's on 22, which is like a medium. When it hits zero, it's about to shut off. Well, just like that. Um, once it's off, you have the power up. And the power down. All works well. Um, electromagnetic neutrifier. Um, it's got full magnetism. It also has a variable feature. They take a second to cycle over. There you go, that's the variable, that's how you know it's on. You can set it in percentages all the way up to 100%. You also have residual and a DMAG cycle. Um, around back, um, it has a Gray Mills coolant pump. It's a wet base machine. Gray Mills Superflow. Just fill it up with coolant and it's ready to go. We did just paint it. I think I said that already. It's in really nice shape and ready to make parts. Thanks for watching our video.